Lance Briggs was born in Los Angeles and made his way down through the state with moves to Oakland and then finding a home in Sacramento at the age of four. His mom took a job with the city of Sacramento. Residing in Meadowview, Lance wouldn't stay in the same place for very long. He attended three different elementary schools and two different high schools. The family moved several times, not staying in the same house or neighborhood for more than six months at a time. Things were difficult growing up for Lance, but he found sports. He played baseball at Florin Little League, and then he fell in love with football. There was one problem. He was a very small kid and didn't weigh enough to play Pop Warner football. Weighing in at 63 and 3 quarters pounds, he was a quarter pound shy of the necessary weight limit. Once he gained weight, he didn't play very much. When it was time for high school, he attended Florin, but didn't have the grades, so he wasn't allowed to play his freshman year. He transferred to Elk Grove, which turned out to be the beginning of something good, and would define him as a player and a person. After taking extra time to get his grades up, Lance played JV his sophomore year and was an elite running back and linebacker. His junior year was a real turning point as he was part of one of the best varsity programs in the area. The Thundering Herd went on to win the section championship in 1997 and 98, and Lance was a big part of it. His senior season, Elk Grove went undefeated and he was named the Sacramento Area Player of the Year. After sifting through scholarship offers from everywhere, Lance decided on the University of Arizona. Playing the same position as former Wildcat linebacker and fellow Sacramento Sports Hall of Famer Teddy Bruschi, Lance was a perfect fit for the Desert Swarm defense. Lance Briggs will be everywhere today. He is a superstar in the Pac-10. He actually started off playing both offense and defense. He played fullback and tailback his first year until the coaches realized they had something special with Lance, the linebacker. He became a two-time All-Pac-10 selection, leading the Wildcats in tackles and sacks. In 2003, the NFL came calling, and in the third round, Lance Briggs' name was called by the Chicago Bears. With the Bears, he shined, teaming with fellow linebacker Brian Urlacher, forming one of the best defensive tandems in the NFL. In 2005, he helped lead the Bears into the playoffs as one of the top defensive teams in the league. In 2006, Chicago had a magical season. After winning the NFC North division for the second straight year, they finished the regular season with the NFL's best record of 13-3. The Bears went into the playoffs as the number one seed. After defeating Seattle in overtime, Chicago faced off against Drew Brees and the Saints. Brees throws it away again. Under duress, Lance Briggs was coming in on him. Lance was the second leading tackler for the Bears that day, including two tackles for losses, and the Bears buried the Saints 39-14 to advance to their first Super Bowl since 1985. In Super Bowl 41, Chicago would face another legendary quarterback in Peyton Manning and the Indianapolis Colts. In a rain-soaked game in Miami, the Bears' run would come to an end. Although the Bears lost, Lance was at his best as he was the leading tackler in the game. He had 13 of them, including 11 solo takedowns. His outstanding play earned him seven straight Pro Bowl selections from 2006 to 2012, an amazing feat that only a handful of players can lay claim to. He also earned three All-Pro selections. Lance was one of the most prolific defensive players in the NFL. In his 12 years, he accumulated over 1,100 tackles with 15 sacks, 16 forced fumbles, 16 interceptions, and scored five defensive touchdowns. He was elected team captain of one of the league's best defenses. He will always be remembered as a hard-nosed player that succeeded at all levels and a player that came back to his roots to start businesses, charitable organizations, and camps for kids. We salute one of Sac Towns and Elk Grove's finest players and welcome Lance Briggs into the Sacramento Sports Hall of Fame.